really should be hunting more animals because I need their delicious, delicious meats. Saving these for the trail. Boars. of robots must be close to a signal I have a unidentified signal powerful processing core of unknown design ooh so the cauldrons might be factories yeah but I, I do need its ooh, a quab Watchers. I don't know. There's not a lot of sneaky grass over here. I don't think. Um, it's a it's a mic I have in my like day a, a arm attached to my desk, so I can kind of um, bend it, move it around, put it more or further away. But uh, it's not the best mic. Um, it's not an XLR, I think it's XLR mics, just a, a USB one, so like there's other, other stuff I'm missing out as far as ability to control my microphone. Let's get this party started. Let's get it started in here. Right. Yep. Ooh. Oh, ooh. Mmm, mistakes have been made. Okay, I don't know what that does. Quab, go away, Quab. I don't want to fight you, Quab. Oh, I'm too close. I'm too close. I'm really glad there's no stamina bar. Monster Hunter, I would be riding that zero stamina edge while doing all these dodge rolls. Out already? Ow! What the heck? What the? Wow. All right. Uh, crabs can crabs cause a lot of problems. Holy crap! Yeah, it might be. It might be just the effect of how the uh, how it's removing um, some of the low level sounds, like from my my keyboards. Might might have to later adjust that to be not as aggressive. This is probably cutting out a lot of my a lot of my lower sounds just because I kind of like had it auto like I said to sort of analyze my environment. If that makes sense, and just kind of mash the keyboard some, and just kind of left it at where it ended up. But, uh, other than anything like that, I've been doing pretty great. 
feeling pretty happy. I got pretty good games working on. I think I'm gonna try and keep to a schedule like kind of test it out this week of going Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I think I'm gonna try Mondays for Hollow Knight, Fridays for Horizon Zero Dawn, and I think Wednesdays will kind of be probably just like whatever roguelike I feel like playing. I might alternate between um, Bullets per Minute and uh, Against the Storm. Everything I'll get is if I, uh, if I uh, start doing some heat saber or something along those lines. Definitely not scrap. This must be the cauldron Drow was talking about. There's got to be a way in somehow. Well, I mean, I put the duct tape on the bow, and I just kind of, kind of laid on it. Quite a door, but how to open it? I didn't. I didn't want to. I didn't want to have to use any magic. It's kind of a pain in the ass. Oh, I got to hold the override. I'm in. I've hacked the mainframe. We're in the Gibson. We have the big iron. Time to hack the planets. Oh uh, hey Empress. They are doing pretty great. I had a I had a mild scare that my my uh odd island might have been in trouble because he was kinda he was acting kinda funny. But uh turns out uh all he did was break his heating panel so it was hanging down and making his area too hot on one side. He was all curled up on the other trying to uh stay cool enough. So, fixed, fixed it for now, but I'm, I'm gonna have to look into getting him a new enclosure because it's kind of old anyway, and I kind of want, I have a, I have a, I have a couple friends who recently got, um, upgrades to their reptile enclosures, and I kind of want to get what they got. Metal. Yeah, he's right. an absolute it's dummy, because he would... He would wedge himself against the top and the heating panel, and I guess slowly, I guess he worked the uh, the screws or whatever. Yeah, the screws out of the uh, the top. Yeah, I've got I've got two snakes still. Uh, I used to have more, but um, I moved to a like place a pipe. that limits my numbers. I feel like this gas will damage me. Non toxic gas. Okay. This is where it ends. There we go. Gotcha. Yeah. Well, they're. They're normal snakes. They're not dragons. You know, I guess. It's like a, it's like a, like a human keeping, keeping a, keeping a little monkey. You know. Uh, they definitely quite destructive. When I had a my little hog nose, I actually had a uh, planted vivarium for him. So I had like actual soil. I had real plants, uh, some succulents, uh, and olivera, I think. Um, some little cleanup bugs, like little isopods, things like that, and. Um, I don't know if you know hog noses, but they like to burrow. And, uh, oh, he loved to burrow. 
and uh, destroyed all the plants by turning them over. But other than that, we did seem to thrive. So at least we have that going for us. Perhaps the robots do not do any form of procreation. They're just purely manufactured. Can I, can I harvest a rat? <laughs> oh no! Beardy seem to love, love hammocks. I think ev mo most every, most every person I see who's got a beardy, like their beardies always try and hang out in those hammocks. The best I've done is just, um, so for my hog island, his enclosure, I did a I was in a kind of a DIY mood so I made a background for him. Yeah, beard dragons are uh, lizards. They're they're one of the more common ones. You probably have seen one. Um, it's like the I think on I think I added it on uh BTTV's the quack 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 emote kind of thing with a little lizard laughing. Uh, that's a bearded dragon. They got like a little spiky, spiky thing on their under chin that looks like a beard. A thing. They usually have like a kind of a little pancake looking body. Great. But um, made a custom background. Using, um, half of it was kind of stone. Half of it was more plant-like. And for the stone side, what I did is I got some, what is it, dry lock? Um, and I watered it down with a little bit of, with, with a little bit of water, just kind of thin it out, just kind of a paste. And then I applied it over some, like, uh, insulation foam, um, Square people, it's, it's like that, those pink rectangles you get at like Lowe's or Home Depot or whatever. Uh, I, I basically used that and cut it down into roughly the shape of a rock calm, calm. and then uh, painted over that with the dry lock. So it had a little bit of a rough texture. Um, and then in the background, I used some of that like expanding foam as well to also attach and put it out. And then for the woodsy side, I got a, I got some of my soil mixture I had left over, mixed that with the dry lock to create a kind of um, earthy paste, and I put that over the other half, and in that half I also had a giant, like, tree branch thing. Um, I didn't make my hog islands bioactive, I was really thinking about it because there there is a um, really cool ball python bioactive like explosion build I've seen. Might be able to take me somewhere. Um, that is just really sick that they did. I, I think it was like a four by four total enclosure with like a good two feet of like the drainage and soil and all that. Um, and it was for a ball python, and it just had, it was even more extra. Oh, I need to, I need to grab, I need to jump and grab. How food is shipping? Might regret this. I hope I don't. It's true. The machines are built in these places. But why? And by who?
Oh, please don't tell me this is going in a circle and I have to jump off at a specific point. I've got as far as this thing would take me. Okay, I was starting to look a little samey and I was getting a little worried. The second there, I thought I fell to my death. This is this is a lot of um, like bismuthy stuff, like very hard angles, jagged edges. <laughs> yeah, y'all are the ones trapped. Although y'all do have warm up pythons. That's my, uh, that's the other snake I have. That's native to Australia. She is a boober. Ow. Okay, there's fall damage. First time I've run into it. Okay, I can heal while oh, I right. oh, I need to grab on that. Need to drop down. Need to drop down. Gosh dang it, I was trying to break this so we cut off the air or the, uh, the viewing angle. Whatever, we'll do this the hard way by shooting all of them right in the eye. Oh, there's a quab. That's why I wouldn't have wanted the alert. Oh no. I have actually not found a uh, wild snake. For whatever reason, it always seems to elude me. Ah! Quab! Quab! Peace! Quab wave! Quab wave! Oh boy! Nah. Not for not for snakes of that size. It's more it's more surprising than uh than painful. I mean, venomous ones, that's that's a you know, whole different calculation. Wow. Okay, he grabbed us a triple hit. Did it just taunt me? What the hell? Yeah, I think, uh, what, the, the brown snakes in Australia are not haze brown snakes. It's like an actual specific venomous snake. Bloody hell, I did it again. Yeah, I the only thing I remember is that Australia has some very generic sounding names for a lot of their very venomous snakes.
No sneaking. Where am I? All right. Do not have a weapon to pierce an energy shield. Oh no! It's like just the right size for a gap to head. like to not die. Thank you. Oh my gosh. I can't be missing those. Where, what, what am I getting stuck on? do is when I get her out um, she'll kind of you know, she'll be out and about and at, at some point she'll kind of turn in my hands and she'll kind of like nose her face against my hand like she's searching for the, the head of a rat and then she'll slowly open her mouth and just slowly bite down and she'll just be like that for a couple minutes, and then she'll just let go and go back to slithering. She's like, it's warm. It kind of smells like food. Let me let me just check real quick. Frilled neck lizard hospital. Whoa! I didn't I didn't think those things were very big. Because they got, they got sharp. Oh yeah, yeah. If you're that young, oof. Yeah, that can be painful. Gray omen. You know, if there were mushrooms called gray omen, I would not assume they would be medicinal. In fact, I would imagine eating them would be a very painful death.
Now I wonder if I hack the heart, will it turn the nearby robots into automatically allied ones? So I wonder if there's gonna be like a, an area control aspect of this. And if it is that case, I wonder if a red corruption is someone else with a burrito who made it into a cauldron of some flavor. A fire boy. This is how machines are made. Woven out of the bag. Access. Okay, so I gotta get up there. Noted. This whole create a light thing is a little. So kind of static. Um, not a new mic. I made a couple changes. I was. I kind of felt like my keyboard clacked a bit loud. I kind of, kind of tried to recalibrate a bit. Made some adjustments to also compensate since the, uh, the noise removal floor is higher. It certainly seems like it may have gone a little too far in the other direction. I'll need to spend some time this weekend. Really, really messing with the mic. Or just reset it to how I had it. <laughs> Very easy. Spawners! Ah! Okay, not good, not good. I'd probably put on our maybe we go find some hats or maybe some other way to dress up. And we have a little bit too fresh to be having too many specific models at this moment. Ah, I rolled right into the fire! Oh, this sucks. I don't have trees to block their fireballs this time. Ah! I am not liking my odds here.
what I would give if I had uh, mounted combat from Monster Hunter against this guy. What? I was completely out of his way. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Oh, that's only half his health. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Oh no 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 no. And I miss his fat ass right there. Santa hat, a sack. Actually, really should get a uh, snake pad over. It. <laughs> that would be cursed. Ah, uh, get over the wall. Ah. I am almost dead. This is going for me. I would like to live, but I've got no more AP. <laughs> well, I'm gonna need the AA guns, because I'm gonna have to shoot down Santa to uh, take his place. Oh, thank God for iframes. Oh, gosh. I feel like I'm so underleveled or I'm missing like a good weapon or something. No! No, 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 no! Why won't you die? Just die! Oh my bloody hell! It just wouldn't drop! Better have given me some good loot. I assume purple's good loot. <laughs> He's gotta land sometime. And if he won't, we'll bring him down ourselves. Why are rocks? Sigma overrides available. Scrapper, Sawtooth, Lancehorn, Grazer. Wait, I already had Grazer. Oh, I got the Sabertooth. Ooh, Ooh I have 
three skill points. Um, increase inventory slots. All right. So I think that's the last of the utility ones. Now I need to actually go for combat stuff because obviously my combat's not going so well. Actually, I wanted to see if I could upgrade my bow because I assume handling is how fast I aim. So I want to make that much better. I don't think it's purely ride, because the, um, the eyeball ones, they just become allies that fight with me. But the, the deer, I can ride. So I don't know if I can ride the saber tooths. Although they're certainly big enough for me to hop up on their back. But I mean, even if they just become uh, a, a combat buddy, uh, they are a hell of a combat buddy. Oh, there is a good bit of map. Okay, let's see. Um, Rocky Zone. What is this? Yeah, we'll we'll hit those corrupted zones on our way to just Yeah, we'll we'll hit the corrupted zones on our way to clear this errand. Yeah, we'll have to we'll have to find one then. We'll have to fuck around and find out, as one might say. I don't see any over here, though. Never know when I might need these. I'll certainly find one eventually. Actually, I do need to kill Boris. I need your skin! Uh, there's not a cutscene. Uh, those crabs um, that I that I that I ran into on my way to that uh, what they call it cauldron? I call it a cauldron. Um, that crab was a new enemy I hadn't seen before, um, and I didn't I didn't really do anything special when I first saw it. So I think they I think they just have the creatures scattered throughout the map, and you can just sort of encounter them whenever. But I do know that. Some spawn locations have a level of variance because um, while I was running all the way over here for all these quests um, when I first started today, there was a spawn with a, a fellow bat and a saber tooth that I got mulched on, but when I came back, it was two fellow bats. And you know, I ended up dying again and came to those Anyway. It seems like there might be like, there are X numbers, there, there's a possibility of, you know, this range of creatures. I, I imagine it's like per load. Where am I? I keep hitting tab expecting it to open my map. It's Gets hushed enter. The trees.
we got corrupted here. Weakness is fire. Burn, baby, burn. They're on fire. Burn, baby, burn. Ah, 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 go away, go away, go away. I don't want you to blow up on me. Don't blow up on me. Don't blow up on me. They're scanning for me. There you go. All's fine. All's fine. The best part of them exploding is like if there's any rabbits or anything around them, they'll just, they'll just kill those as well. <laughs> Get a bunch of fresh meat. That'll keep my stomach quiet. Or fatty meat. Actually, I need to make some cheese. Crafting. Potions. Health potions. Cannot make many. I will attempt. And uh let me know let me know what you munch on when you get back. For the trail. Ooh, a saber tooth. We can fuck around and find out. Find cover. That is sneaky. This tiny bush hides me. Okay. Okay, dude. Up and around there. I'm gonna hide in these. Oh shit, no, I can't. Curious, aren't you? Come on. I know how to override a sawtooth. If I can get in close. Doggy, 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 doggy. It's happy time. All right. No to writing, but that does still mean we have a pretty jacked ally. Um, robot, what are you doing? What are you doing, bruv? Ow. I don't understand.
There we go. You know, I don't like that thing that's counting down. I get the feeling that's a, uh, a timer on how long it stays hacked. If I attack a hacked robot, will it become hostile? Yes. Yes, it will. I scarred. You're the one that scarred. I feel like meleeing actually was easier. Oh, I thought that said sushi roll and donuts. You're like that's a uh, that is a combination. <laughs> Can't say that I know what a salad roll is. It seems like a salad wrap. Not gonna be a problem overriding this next one. Can't you? Whoa! Jump! Oh, that's not. Oh, lancers are different. They're gazelles. They have stabby horns instead of dingy horns. I like tomato sauce. I can deal with, you know, some some sauce and tomatoes and stews and such. But party little plant, you'll help. Tomatoes on hamburgers never never was my jam, or even like cherry tomatoes inside salads. It's, it's just too too goopy. <laughs> I see nothing. Ah, I can't ride the grazer either. All right, so I can only ride the. I guess I can only ride the um, little the the doggos. That's certainly a bugger. <laughs> that is uh, one way to take it out. Oh God, they're still exploding. Well, hopefully they're uh, they're like cherry tomatoes, so you can just pick them out and chuck them. I'm not even close. To Oh, 
this is a dude boring. <laughs> you understand? Save this for later. Valuable resources protected. Are they valuable? Are they? Or is it just more junk? Alright. Soon scavenger box. We'll get some time to use. Back to your business. I just swore there was some animals over here that should have died. Yeah, there it is. Good meat. Still don't know where Tam's ring is. Find Tam's ring. Oh, it's gonna be over there. Well, that's just dumb. Damn it, Tam. I give you your name. Ooh, it's a suspicious area. You should come and check it out. Right, I can only ride the gear, apparently. Oh, and I think we, we ran into a uh, saber tooth while you were grabbing Noms. Uh, can't ride it. But, it does fight. It also does not stay permanently hacked. There's like a, a timer that counts down. Also learned if you a attack a hacked robot, it will immediately turn hostile. So couldn't really soften him up too much before he uh, wanted to fight. Oh, that was an awful sound. This will last. Damn arrows, You're bro. Orn? Aren't you a little young to be a sentinel? <laughs> you can talk. Fair. The war chief had me bring you these fire arrows. Send up a signal the moment you see anything suspicious, all right? I know, I know. I'm young, not stupid. <laughs> if they come back... Just be safe. The trip down's the best part. Huh. He only has, like... Very small amount of face paint. I wonder if the face paint is like sort of the uh, rank in society sort of thing, or like a so like you come of age and you get like your first markings, and then maybe maybe like maybe you start a family and you get the next set of markings, or maybe like just 
denotes maybe your rank in various structures. I need, to, I need to pay more attention to who has, like, the most elaborate face paints for Nora's. Pooping, but there certainly is head pats. <laughs> Speed hack! Nope! Mistakes have been made. Oh, it isn't. Oh, I forgot I did that. <laughs> oh, I remember why I did that. Uh, I was... I was watching, um... Raid Raw stuff. Uh, they're working on a thing. They're working on a thing. And, uh... They, they drew... They did, like, a really quick doodle of their character looping Scooping the character reference, Snoop. That was adorable. I can't wait till their, their thing is finished, because I certainly want to have that available as well. Implement a few other things, because uh, I do want some variations on, on the model, and then I want to set up like either automatic model switching, or some kind of redeem switch system, I don't know. I Got one. I like having different op form options, because like, my original idea was I would have like a base, like the, the base snake form, like the pattern, the morph, would be like adjustable, if that makes sense. So I could be like different different kinds of snakes. Okay, I am not. I haven't talked to a merchant in a while. I probably have a lot of stuff taking up space that's just sell fodder. And also they might have armor, new armors. I haven't bought a new armor since like the beginning of the game. <laughs> <laughs> 